it's me. I'm so, 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 so sorry that I have not been updating a lot. I've been really busy school starting and I'll try to update more. I'm so sorry. Anyways, I have my January favorites. So I'll go first with my soap of the month that I love that's like almost gone. Look how sad that little sliver is. Little honeycomb on top. That is the there you go. That is the Lush Honey I Washed the Kids bath soap. It smells really good. I tried it out and I really like it and as you can tell because it's like almost gone. And one of my faves. Absolutely love it. it. Smells so good. Makes me really like calm and relaxed and my lips taste really good which I guess brings me to my next favorite. Sorry I keep licking my lips but they taste so good. So, I will not do it anymore. Ready? You ready? Okay. Anyways, my next favorite is this. How do I put it the right way? That's upside down. There we go. This Juicy Fruit Chapstick. It tastes just like the Juicy Fruit Gum. It is so weird. I love it. It is so good, but it's so weird. But, yeah, my mom gave it to me for Christmas, and I tried it out, and... Love it. It's what I use now and hopefully I won't run out for a while because this tube is huge. Look how big this tube is compared to like, I don't know where my other lip balms are, but look how big this tube is. Like this thing is huge. Like, it's like double the size of a normal chap tube of chapstick. Anyways, next I have my awesome uh, I got it on sale, 35% off, but what? Big sexy hair hairspray. It's the spray and play hairspray. It's like ginormous. I love it. I use it all the time when I curl my hair, and I curl my hair a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Like a lot, a lot, a lot. And ting, love it. And what I, my favorite curling iron, I have a few curling irons actually. My favorite curling iron is this one. It's, doo -doo -doo. it's a Revlon one inch and it has a heat protectant it's not hot right now but put it on so I don't lose it it's my favorite it has like an automatic off which is good for forgetful me and like 30 settings on it I have it like at 25 so I don't totally kill my hair but I really really like this it's my favorite curling iron and obviously it's in my favorites Duh. okay so then my favorite, I'm just like going all over the place, I really am, I don't know why, I'm just kind of picking up the pile, and anyways, distracted, Lulu. distracted. Okay, anyways, this is going to be a really weird video, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry, like, I love y'all, I'm sorry, fingers long, I can't do it right, okay, heart, I love y'all, I'm so sorry, this is like such a weird video, anyways, this is my favorite pre-styling spray. It smells like pumpkin and spice. It's so good. It is the pumpkin enzyme mist. And it is so good. It's healthy sexy hair from I guess the people who make big sexy hair. Sexy hair people. I love them. I really do. I didn't even notice that until right now. But I got this in a set. It has this and it has a leave-in hair conditioner with it and they both smell really good but the leave-in conditioner is like a balm type of thing and usually I just like spraying stuff in my hair because it's easier and it doesn't get my hands all sticky so love this it smells good yay I my favorite I'm trying a whole bunch of different nail polishes like this month is like my nail polish month so my favorite of the whole are nail polishes yeah nail polishes okay anyways the nail polish I have on right now is called Park Avenue, and it's NYC in the New York Minute, like, fast dry nail polish, and I actually, like, the other, like, standard, the normal, like, dollar NYC nail polishes, I'm not really a big fan of. They don't really do the trick for me. This one is, like, amazing. It is really, really thick. It's, like, dollar seventy-two or something, but it's actually, like, pretty thick thick and this was 
two coats and it actually does dry really really fast and I was quite impressed by this because I was not impressed by the other ones but yes so impressed by this one not my favorite my favorite is the Mercury Rising by Sinful Colors I actually have a video on this as my nail of the day the other ones aren't as good as this one at least the other ones that I've tried. There's a couple of them I haven't tried yet, but the other ones I've tried aren't as good as this one. This one is amazing. Like, one coat thick, holy covered nail. Whoa! Amazing. Love it. I don't know if it's just like a fluke one, but I'm happy I got it. It's so pretty. Brown with like sparkles in it. And it's, it's, I love it. It's pretty. It's my favorite that I've tried so far out of, I guess, the ones that I've been most surprised about. It's the one I've been most surprised about and therefore it is my favorite because I actually do like quite a few of my nail polishes and that jacket's doing something weird. Okay. My favorite top and base coat is the Orly top to bottom and really like it. I use it like all the time which can you tell there's like a giant air bubble? No you can't really tell. Oh well. But yeah there's like not much gone, I guess. I use it a lot. I love it. It's like free of a good amount of dangerous chemicals that most aren't. So yeah, does a great job. Look, they're shiny. So it does a good job. I love it. Okay. Obviously, I love it. It's in my favorites. Duh. Anyways, lip gloss. I got the like Stila holiday whatever collection of lip glosses. And do do do. Focus. I can't really get a good picture of that. Oh, there you go. Okay. Um, this one is called Seashell. It has It's pink. You can't tell that there are sparkles in it, but there are sparkles in it. And not really sparkles, like a shimmer. I'm wearing it now. And this has been my favorite one for the month. I really, really like it. It's just like a sheer pinky color. And um, like I said, I'm wearing it now. And I'm also wearing my favorite lip balm. These are all I'm wearing. Next, I have my favorite mascara, which is mascara I've been like wearing all month. It's my splurge mascara. It's like $18, but I love it. And you see my lashes? Yeah, I love it. My lashes look so beautiful with this. It is the Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. And so, so, so good. Um, let's see if I can get the wand. Don't knock over. Okay. Well, I don't even need that. Let's see. Okay, so that's the wand, and it has like the little bristles on it, and I, I really love it because I don't like a lot of like big volumey lashes. There is a story behind this. This is not. Don't fall. Okay, this is not my favorites, but this is what I got. I think I got it for my birthday in like October, but I never used it, and then I realized, oh hey, I can like take these little small bottles with me to school and put them in my purse and then I don't have to worry about it and yeah like for Riz yo and I'm not ghetto I don't know why I'm trying anyways and the one that I have that is my favorite that I've tried so far and it's like the one that's been used up the most is sexy little things and it is so good I can't really describe it. let's see it's like a floral type sweet smell I guess is the best way to say it because it's not super sweet because super sweet smells just oh I can't stand them they're gross super sweet oh can't do it nope nope can't do it anyways um candle it's like a cheap Walmart like vanilla candle but I was surprised this thing is strong it like made my whole room smell without even lighting it and when I light it it smells really really good look see it's almost gone I did not forget okay look see it's almost gone and it smells really good. I was surprised. I like it. Yay, $3 candle. Yay, $3 candle. You smell good. Woo! Okay. And that was my January favorites. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed. Subscribe, please. Say, happy birthday, mommy. I don't think you're going to watch this, but I'm still going to say it because today is my mom's birthday. So, happy birthday, mommy. I love you. Mwah. Love you, mommy. Okay. Bye, all. Bye, my mommy. Bye. Happy birthday. Tell my mom happy birthday, even though you probably don't know her, but...
Bye.